Is it najis or not? Is it physically impure or not? Because this would affect a number of other things. So if I apply it externally, do I have to wash it before praying or not? So if it is pure alcohol and I have it in a swipe and uh, a swap and I uh, clean my wound to pray, do I have to wash it? The answer is no. So some say, okay, because this is not wine. I understand. This is alcohol. What about physical alcohol? Uh, that is wine. If someone pours a glass of wine on my trousers or a drop of vodka falls accidentally from the passenger sitting next to me on an international flight, which I have no control over, and turbulence, and it falls on me. Can I pray? It's an issue of dispute. And the most authentic opinion is that intoxicants are not physically impure, but rather spiritually. And there are evidences proving that. Among them is that the Prophet ﷺ ordered the companions to spill out their savings and whatever they had stored of wine when the prohibition was revealed to him and the rivers of wine was pouring in the streets of Medina and no one considered walking on that to be impure and would affect their prayer in the masjid. Among other evidences. So it is not physically impure. And this is why when we have a bottle of perfume that has alcohol in and you apply it on yourself and your body, you go to pray with that. There's no problem in that. So using it externally is okay if there's a need to it, as in the case of perfume. 